Hi again, YouTubers. So I am sitting down today to do a video all about what you guys can expect from my channel over the summer. For those of you that are newer to my channel, might not realize this, is that I go away every summer to my home up north. And that's where I spend my summers. My husband still comes in and out through this house all of the time. He has meetings here. He has to come back for work things. But I pretty much leave when school's over, go up there, and I stay until school is about ready to start. So uh, how my channel tends to change is typically through the winter. I do videos every Tuesday and Friday. Through the summer, I try, <laughs> try to do at least one video a week. That being said, I did tape some videos before I'm getting ready to leave here. Um, this video is going to be my first video that goes up just for one this week. Um, next week you will have one and so on and so forth. Um, I did tape a makeup haul, a get ready with me, which is like my basic everything I'm wearing today is probably the exact same stuff. Um, a clothing haul video I am going to before I leave also try to sit down and tape a sunglass collection video so many questions from people on my Instagram stories about my sunglass collection because I have a little holder back here that's in this room um, so I am gonna try and sit down and do that so we'll see if I get to that but these videos will kind of be spaced out even the ones I already did so as an example like this week this video will be going up for you guys and next week maybe the makeup haul or the get ready with me or the clothing haul and so on and so forth so the videos that I'm doing before I leave the get ready with me the clothing haul the makeup haul and the sunglass one um, hopefully that's four videos so that's the four videos you're gonna see the first month I'm gone which works out really well for me because you have to keep in mind, my first two to three weeks there are always crazy. The first week is, you know, unpacking everything, getting everything settled. We also built onto the house. We added three new rooms and a bathroom. So we have furniture being delivered. We've ordered carpets. We've ordered all kinds of stuff. Like, so not carpets, rugs. I guess that's the difference, right? Because carpets, we put carpet down in some of the rooms, but we ordered new rugs for upstairs. Anyway. Um, if you are interested at all on any of these things, you can go over and follow me on my Instagram. My Instagram handle is the same as here. It's LisaSZ09. I will put that below. Um, but I do a lot of stories there. So it's more kind of things as they're happening. Um, show you the beach we go to, some of the restaurants we go to, some of the things we do, whatever have you. I do outfits over there, like what I'm wearing. Now keep in mind, two things to keep in mind about where I live in the summertime is one I'd say 80% of the days I'm in a swimsuit and a cover-up at the beach so you're not gonna see that much variations during the day however uh, at night we go out to dinner a lot more there than we do here so and sometimes go downtown shopping and things like that but up there it is like a high of like mid 80s during the day and then at night it's usually in the 70s so a lot of times at night I'm not particularly wearing maybe what you guys would be wearing in the summertime heat like here in Maryland it is a lot warmer than where I am there so I'm wearing like jeans and a little top with like a jacket so it may or may not be your summer style but I will show you guys those different things that I'm wearing I post them on Instagram I also do the Instagram stories when I think of it I also tend to have people in and out of my house through the whole summer. People come and stay with us. People come and visit. We have friends that live up there that we're always in and out of each other's houses and doing stuff together. And just, I go there to enjoy my summer with my family. My in-laws live close. Um, my my family comes to visit we just have a lot of people in and out and so i am much busier up there so i don't have the time particularly to stop and sit or the space there to sit and tape a video or two videos every single week plus the time it takes to sit and edit and all of those things it just doesn't happen during the summer and i don't kid myself i used to try and pre-tape so much before i left and i would sit there and try and load one and edit and it doesn't always happen and i it's like setting yourself up for failure and i don't tend to do that i tend to be realistic i am realistic with the fact that i try to post at least once a week on a wednesday but if that doesn't happen there's weeks that i don't get to it 
I post on Instagram. I post on Instagram stories when I can. Um, I will try and take you, a lot of you are following my fitness journey, my eating habits, things like that. I will take you along with that through my Instagram stories on, you know, if I'm working out, how I'm working out, what I'm trying to eat and things like that. I take a lot of uh, videos and pictures of things we're eating up there because it is a different style of food. New England definitely has its own style of food to it. So I just wanted to make sure that everyone had an idea of what was going to be going on. I do not buy hardly, I don't, I mean, I buy maybe one or two things of makeup throughout the summer. And most times they're just if I ran out of something that I love. Like, I do not buy much as far as makeup or any of that at all. Um, as far as clothing, rent the runway unlimited i'll post my uh review of that or like my video about that below but is that is going to be the majority of how i change my clothes up this summer i also don't realistically i used to pack so much of my stuff here i am paring down what i'm packing and taking with me as far as clothing i'm good at that with makeup but as far as clothing i'm going to pare that down and kind of bring real true basics and then use rent the runway to supplement outfit ideas that i have however that being said I do do a little bit of shopping up there, but it is usually like boutique shopping, like stuff that you can only get if you call that boutique. So I think most of that stuff is going to be held to Instagram stories rather than doing a clothing haul. In July, end of July is the Nordstrom, the Nordstrom sale. Is it just called the Nordstrom sale? It's not the anniversary sale. They call it end sale. The yearly sale? I don't even know. They're once a year, their big sale, the first time they do, like the one time a year they do the items that are for the next season coming up. So it'll be the items for fall versus like right now, if you went to the last sale they had, it was all the stuff they were getting rid of from the last season. This is the one time a year that they go through and have a huge, huge, huge sale on items that are for the next season coming up. So I usually have a haul or two of those. Um, but yeah, so that is kind of the basis of my summer is the easiest way to put it. Um, it is definitely always a learning curve as I do it. Every year it is slightly different. So I do try to keep as updated as I possibly can on social media and things like that. Um, I would say Instagram is the best way other than YouTube. And But the YouTube is a once a week video and it might not be that current week. Whereas YouTube or Instagram and Instagram stories is much more like current, what I'm doing right then in the moment. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed this little video. I do, I did have a lot of requests for people last year, I remember this, to show a video of what I like packed and what I think I'm gonna do when I get there is I'm gonna kind of do a video of like what makeup I took with me maybe. And maybe I'll do a video if you guys are interested on the staple pieces I took with me as far as clothing, shoes, things like that. You guys let me know if that's something that interests you. So I hope this little video was helpful to you guys. It tells you a little bit about what to expect over the summer. I hope you guys all have a wonderful summer. You enjoy it wherever you are, whatever you're doing. If you have kids that are out of school, go and enjoy it. You know, play with them, have fun. Like just enjoy your time with them. They're only little ones is kind of my theory. So I want to go and I just love enjoying the time with MJ during the summer because it's, it's a lot of he and I doing things together too, which is even if it's just going to the beach, it's, it's nice. I really enjoy it. What I'm wearing on my face is pretty much Actually, it is exactly the same as what I had on the Get Ready With Me other than I use the MAC Pro Longwear Concealer under my eyes. Everything else is the same. I have on the Salon Perfect 110 lashes. I'm not sure which one I had on for the video. Um, and my lips, I showed two lips in that video, I think. This one is the MAC Velvet Teddy, and that's it. The shirt is an older one from Babu, I can never say that brand. I don't think they make this anymore, unfortunately. The earrings, you guys know, I'm obsessed with this style of earring now. It's all I wear from Nickel and Suede. These are just, these are the white ones and I love them. They're just so stinking cute. So thank you so much for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed this. If you have any questions whatsoever, as always, please post them below. And as always guys, thanks so much for watching and have a great day.